Hello, it has been some time since I last posted a video on this channel. You know, sometimes life gets in the way. I've moved into this lovely new house. I have my own room. This is for my office and streaming and gaming and all that kind of stuff. And on today's video, I'm going to show you how to get the full Football Manager experience. Will that ever, will that, there we go, on your Android tablet or mobile devices or ios we're going to use steam link for this it's really cool i mean it's the full experience so you know go to your squad if you want to go to your squad there have a mess around with your uh with your tactics you know you've got the full experience here and i'm going to show you how to do that on this video and the first stop is actually downloading steam link on your mobile or tablet device let's go so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go to Google Play and we're going to type in Steam. Now, one thing we can't get confused about is, is the actual Steam app. We're not downloading that. Look, I've put a massive cross through here. We're not downloading that. We're actually downloading Steam Link. Steam Link. Um, wait until I click on this. There we are. So look, look, this is Steam Link. It's not Steam. And we're going to look to install that. Look, green tick means install. So please... um. Please install. And whilst we're waiting for this, another important thing which we need to remember is both your device and and your um, computer need to be on the same Wi-Fi. So just make sure that's the case when when we're going through this. Obviously, you can't Steam, you can't cast, etc., to a device which isn't sharing the same network. And um, this is what you're going to see when you open up Steam Link. And um, you want to be scanning for your computer. And when you find your computer. Um, you want to be clicking it. So once you find your computer, you uh, click it. Normally, it's the only computer in your in your house, and um, it will bring up this pairing screen. So now I'm going to switch over to Future David, and he's going to show you how to run through this when you're actually on Steam. Okay, if that first bit all worked, you should now be with me on the screen. So what I've done here is I've opened Steam. Hopefully, somewhere on this screen, I've also put the message which says how to pair. But what we need to do is we need to go to Steam in the top left hand corner here. Go to settings. Um, now be wary that settings actually opens up on a on a different window when you do that. It's caught me out a few times. You should be able to see it here. We then go to remote play. So we're looking for remote play here. And where it says here, it's um, where it says here, you have to click on pair Steam link. So we'll do that now. Then we just enter the code that we saw on the screen hopefully it, again it's somewhere i'll put it somewhere on this kind of um, thing that you can see here the screen and then we should be paired so what your again i'll try and I'll try and make this a little bit bigger for now what your device should be seeing here is something like this where it now says you are now paired let that kind of focus if it can i'll move out the way how do i do this put it off my head it says it now should be paired with your computer and then we just need to go on to um, the next step and you're all up and running right so we're moving back to the tablet now and all we need to do here is just select a computer so you're on steam link you select your computer and then it's as easy as just clicking you know start playing again you might want to check if your connection is good so you might want to make sure you need the router perhaps um i don't think you need to be near the computer i mean i've used this everywhere so my computer is down in the basement i've used this upstairs in the living room and also you know as i'm as i'm going to sleep as well um in in the bed and it's worked like a charm the only thing which might annoy you is at the end of your session you might then need to run down if you don't like leaving your computer on just running down and switching off your computer i always like to switch off my computer after every time i've played it but you might be a little bit different and um, from here on in it's just the case of loading up football manager as you would and um i'm playing it now be aware because you are steaming this technically the game is running on your computer too and it's sending that message to your tablet or your phone would never advise playing on your phone the screen is way too small but if you have like an ipad pro or one of these new samsung devices where you can't get fm touch this is pretty much perfect for you you can go on there and you can play the full game you aren't playing the touch edition you're not playing the mobile edition you're playing like the, pretty much the full-on football manager experience 
and um, it's pretty good when you're watching football on the big screen in your living room and you are playing that football manager game you can carry it on from your desktop onto onto your tab obviously the quicker your computer is the quicker this will run so here we are playing one of my uh, saves which hopefully i'll be playing on um, twitch or youtube or streaming it at some point and you'll be able to see here Aberdeen is the team I am with and I'm just here showing you what we can go through and what it looks like on your device you know you can click continue what I like to do is drag down these elements because they sometimes do get in the way of the buttons and um, they would be your um your keyboard there and also how you set up the actual conf configuration can be a bit fiddly to start with sometimes you need to go on and Make sure that you're using the mouse option or the touchpad option, depending on how you want to play this. Um, you can even play it with a controller if you want to, because this Steam Link is set up to play whatever game that comes from your PC onto your tablet. And that is how you Steam, Cast, whatever you want to call it. Um, let me know how you get on below, and if you've got any questions, happy to help.